Welcome to our daily tune-up. I have something important to talk to you about today. During this past week, many of my private consultations have had to deal with family issues, issues that have to do with relatives, whether they're sick, some of them are argumentative. Today I want to talk to you about the world and what's going on in our universe and some of the energy that we're feeling that's creating stress and tension. Each one of us have a choice each day when we get up in the morning to decide the kind of a day we're going to have. Each one of us have the opportunity each day to create a new day. You know, any day you wake up in the morning is a blessing. And that's a blessing whether you owe more money than you're making, whether you're really feeling as good as you want to feel, whether your brother or sister is antagonizing you about something personal in your life. It's a blessing if you wake up and the sun's not shining and it's a rainy, cloudy day outside. It means there's still an opportunity there for you. I want you to understand that each one of us living on this planet pretty much go through the same stuff that everyone else does. It feels like we're all by ourselves sometimes. Today, I want you to understand that many of the challenges that you face have been created by you in the way you think about things, in the way you look at things, in the way you hear things. I want you to give yourself permission today to find a new way of seeing the world. Explore new opportunities and do your best to get rid of your myopic view of the way you see things and see it from another person's point of view. Many times another person has a better point of view than we do. They're seeing things that we don't see because we're too close to our own trees. I've experienced this myself and I know you have too. This is a great day. Any day you wake up is a blessing, whether you think it is or not. And right now, in the condition that things are in all around the world, we have many opportunities each day to inspire and help other people become more inspired themselves through the way we act, through the way we behave, and through the way we look at ourselves. So I want you to really, really dig down inside yourself today. I want you to give yourself permission to be extraordinary. Each one of us on this earth have a purpose, and that is to create, that is to inspire, and that is to serve another human being, the highest order there is. Whatever your spiritual belief is, whatever you truly believe is the higher power for you, I want you to call on that power today for strength and guidance. I want you to put a smile on your face. I want you to feel good about who you are. All the people that I've talked to this week have one thing in common. They almost all have the same challenges and they're looking at it a little bit differently. And they're looking at it from their point of view without looking at the other person's point of view. And it's easy to become angry when someone has an opinion on how maybe you ought to live your life. But all they're doing is looking at what they see from their model of the world. And we each have a different model that we look through, different filters. Respect those other filters. You know, you might learn something from it. However, at the same time, you're still responsible for living your life true to yourself. And if someone else has an opinion on how you live your life, honor that opinion, look at it from their point of view, and then make your decision. But relinquish the idea that you have to be angry at them or mad at them because most of the time their intentions are good. Sometimes they just don't deliver that intention the way you would like to hear it. So between now and the next time we speak, I want you to give yourself permission to enjoy today. And every time you wake up in the morning, be glad. It's a blessing and it means you have one more day to create, to improve upon your life, to make things better than you ever thought they could be. Until then, this is Dr. Gary wishing you a great day. And one footnote, be sure to re-opt in to our daily tune-up. This has been so successful, 
I am completely flattered by all of your comments. I appreciate your ability to communicate with me and tell me what you want to hear about. And at the same time, we're growing so fast, we're having to upgrade our system and go to the highest technology available today to create not only this broadcast, but the ones to come in the future. Make sure you re-opt in, go directly to my website at drgary.tv and just simply fill out the form and you will continue to receive these messages. And again, I love you, have a great day and remember, every day is a blessing and sometimes they're a little bit in disguise. Bye bye.